Tonight on EL Now, season three of MTV series Sugar wins big at the World Media Festival. Still on big wins, Nigeria's Tiwa Savage and David O, Ghana's Sakodie, South Africa's Mafiki Zolo, Tanzania's Diamond, and many more on the nomination train for the BET Awards. Catch it all right here. He is back! We have spanking new music coming in from recuperated R&B singer OJB Jezreel. Also on the show today, we take you back in time with a horrorlicious countdown of our top 5 horror movie classics. <laughs> it's a EL now. Alright, men, it is time to step up your game. Dressing well, dressing in a way that attracts, you know, fashionable, smart women is not that difficult. So why do many, many, many men get it wrong? I don't know. But disclaimer, this is not meant for the stylish men who already have their look together. It's for the men who really don't know what women want to see them in and who don't have a fashion gene guiding their way to the right outfit every morning. For those men who know their wear around wardrobe, keep on doing your thing, okay? I think the main reason is that there are so many options and so many images of what you know women think is not and you know many of them not really being realistic for the average guy to mimic and true fashion in the sense of Italian Vogue is not really what most women I know including myself are attracted to and while I can admire a man who has amazing style no one wants a man who is more decked out than she is the woman is the jewel, but that man should be clean, confident, and crisp. Those are my three rules for men to live by when buying clothes. One, one. Exactly. This topic will answer questions that arise when the issue of what women want comes up anywhere, anytime. But well, let's have the news first, then we dive in. Hey guys and welcome. So we suppose congratulations are in order for our African celebs repping tight in Diaspora Awards. The 2014 BET Awards nomination list has arrived with a nomination for Best International Act, Africa category going to South Africa's Mafiki Zolo, Ghana's Lakodie, Tanzania's Diamond Platinums, Togo's Tufan and Nigeria's Davido and Tiwa Savage. No surprise for our couple Jay-Z and Beyonce led nominations in the music category. For movies, Steve McQueen is up against Best Man Holiday and Lee Daniels The Butler amongst others. For the movie 12 Years a Slave featuring Africa's Chiwetele Jofo and Hollywood newbie Lupita Nyong'o. Still on awards, the MTV Staying Alive Foundation and MTV Base Africa have won the Gold Award in Edutainment at the World Media Festival for hit series Sugar which hit your screens on Ebony Live TV in December. This third installment, which featured roles from stars such as Ice Prince, Tiwa Savage, Inyanya, Chris Atta, amongst others, tackled the themes of sex and relationships. It was written by Kemi Adeshoye and directed by Half of a Yellow Sun director, B. Bandele. Great news from NATO C as we hear the rapper has finished work on his new album Yet Unnamed. We gather the rapper is set to release this new offering come September of this year. Just months after a successful kidney surgery in India, Nigerian producer and singer OJB Jezreel has gone back to know what he knows how to do best. Music. He has set sail once again with the release of a new video, Not Afraid. You're not afraid, oh, you're not afraid, oh, yeah, oh The video, which is directed by Yink Reed Films, boasts of an emotional story backed up by great melody, accompanied with OJB's own voice. And finally, it's going down 3 p.m. this Sunday at the Campus Mini Stadium, Lagos Island. We're talking about a free-to-attend celebrity football match Join the cast featuring a battle between comedians such as Ali Baba, Oke Bakasi, Julio Sagu, AY, Bowie versus TV personalities Manny, Yo, Frank Adoho, and many more. The initiative tag Join the Cast uses the community sport football to sensitize communities against malaria, the dangers of self-medication, among other issues. This novelty football match follows a progressive two-day free malaria testing and free malaria drugs issuing exercise on World Malaria Week from April, where over 1,000 people were tested. 
And that's the news. Remember, you can hit us up on ebonylivetv.com forward slash EL now to watch the news again. Coming up, how do women want men to dress like? Find out today on EL Now. And on Strange But True, we present to you some of the difficulties producers face while making superb videos. This is EL Now. Thank you.